家好，欢迎收看本期的搞金的聚力番外篇，我是周文泽。那我现在呢正在上海的 CES Asia 展会上。那今年呢，英特尔和浩翔推出了一个这样一个合作的无人机。那这款无人机呢，我们看到它采用了一个六桨的这么一个设计。这样的设计是为什么呢？平时我们可以以六桨工作，一旦有一个这个螺旋桨损坏，那可以它最立刻转化成一个四桨，从而继续保证一个飞行的平稳。同时呢，这两个这个支撑架呢也可以立起，以保证你在一个三百六十度的旋转。通常的这个浩翔无人机呢，都是以一个超声波来检测前方的一个障碍物。但是这款呢和英特尔合作之后，就有了一个新的功能，也就是我们看到的现在这个，也就是今年英特尔的一个多年来主打项目叫 Real Sense。这个 Real Sense 的这一个传感器是一个什么样的工作原理呢？就是它利用一个红外的发射器以及两个能检测红外射线的这个摄像头来进行一个数据上的合成。我们今天在上之前的这个展会上也已经介绍了，它发射出这个红外射线之后呢，收取到了信号，从而通过这个红外线反射回来这个信息来判断前方的一个景深的状况。通过这样的一个状况，它能够更准确、更快速地判断前方是否有障碍物，从而进行一个。躲避的这样一个操作，好，那我们呢？刚才也是看这个，看了一下刚才这个工作人员的操作。我们来接下来啊，听一听来自 I Triple E 的高级会员 Thomas k o f o l i n 博士，听一听他对这款无人机以及对无人机的发展有怎样的一个看法。How does it really can help the drone in the real life? So the real sense technology allows you to get、uh, depth perception and to see what, what things are closer and what things are further away by using. By processing the stereoscopic images it captures, you can use this to、uh, avoid colliding with things because you can tell where they're at in space. So it can give you more、uh, if you can run in a autonomous or semi-autonomous mode and have、uh, better、uh, control and、um, uh, capability of having accidents, things that sort. So that's what I think it gives you. Also, if you had infrared capability, then it also can let you see: is this a, a living thing? Or is it a rock? Eventually, if you can、uh, combine that with machine intelligence that actually could do object recognition and that sort of processing, you can use that as additional information and make even more intelligent decisions on things that are interesting to look at, things that you want to avoid. Is, is, is something moving? Is it not? Is it a living thing? Is it? Is it not? So I think it gives you a lot more potential capabilities as the technology evolves and as we we do more things with these、uh, autonomous vehicles like drones. 好，那以上呢就是我们在这个浩翔展台对于英特尔和浩翔合作这个无人机的一个简单的上手以及点评。更多资讯，大家依然可以关注腾讯数码，从而关注更多的在 CS Asia 上有趣好玩的产品。